Hello everybody, Saturday afternoon, Wright Ranch Rescue. Here's a bucket of squirrels. <laughs> so they're all different ages. Some of them are, well, none of them have really got any fur. Have we they got any, any fuzzies? They're, called, they're pinkies, they call. So these are, one is three days old and the other ones are like less than a week and other ones a week. What we call them in Australia, we call them pinkies too, but then when they get fur on, we call them fuzzies. And we call them graylings. Oh, graylings, yeah, we don't call them that. What a little and this cutie. One was a so it's, it's healed up nicely. Cross. Look at the eyes on him, will you? Bloody hell. Oh, my God. It's like baby birds. Their eyes look like that, too. It's got a little brown spot on him there. I don't know. That was a bite. He had a bite mark. Oh, he had a big bite mark when I first got him. Thing. So, look, look, you've got handfuls, handfuls of squirrels. It's handfuls just one of batch. <laughs> yeah, I know, guys. I'm telling you, we're getting taken over here by the amount of animals we have. But what do we do? Tell me honestly, what do we do? Someone calls us about this. If mm -hmm. you don't take them, we will euthanize them. What do you want to do? Now, what what, what can you say to that? If they'll just people. That yeah, let them die. Yeah. And so, how, how do we then say, okay, we won't take them. We'll just let them die. It's not possible. But then it becomes impossible with how many that we get. Mm -hmm. This is the dilemma that we face. I mean, we get eaten out of house and home by the animals. We love them to death. But I'm telling you guys, the amount of supplies that we go through with the volume of animals we've got, but it's a catch-22. Elizabeth and I both can't say, ah, nah, just, just let it die. We're golden. You know, so it's, it's, it's tough. And then when you've got this many coming through with this size, poor Elizabeth has got to be up every two to three hours. Uh, yeah, and she's exhausted beyond belief. And, you know, I mean, you know, we, we adore our animals, you know that. I mean, that's why we do what we do. But it is a big, big uh, ask. I'm telling you guys, I understand why, you know, some people say, oh, I'd love to do what you do, but I don't have the time. Well, that's exactly what you need is plenty of it. I can't imagine someone working 10 or 12 hours a day and could not look after babies properly. You can't because they're, they're too demanding. It really is. But anyway, guys, this is just a part of the bucket load of squirrels that we've got. We've got others everywhere sprinkled all over the house. We're different ages. Yeah. Okay, guys, have a good one. Enjoy your Saturday night. Well, I'm trying to get her to finish this one so we can just snuggle up and watch a movie and then she'll be back out doing this again. That's how it is. We can't even get enough time to watch a friggin' movie. Okay, guys, love you all. See ya.